Hello guys, today's topic of this video is how to distribute the teams while drawing a fixture that is on a knockout basis. In a league tournament, each and every team will be playing matches with the other opponents but in a knockout tournament and this is a this is an elimination round so the teams will be divided in two halves that is upper half and the lower half so there are three methods how to distribute these teams and i'll be showing you the first method uh, in this video uh, so how to distribute the teams in the upper half and the lower half so here we got uh, 10 teams which have given their entries for the tournament that is Narayana School, Shanti Niketan School, Oak Ridge High School, Bluebird School, Alphonsus High School, Pragati School, Delhi Public School, Sherwood School, Supreme School and Johnson School. So these 10 teams are going to take part in this tournament and here we have prepared uh, 10 chits because there are uh, 10 teams and we have prepared 10 chits for the lots. And here I am going to draw the fixture I have prepared on a paper and this is the fixture for 10 teams on knockout basis and this is the first method. So totally there are 3 methods I will be showing you the 3 methods. And this is the first method. So now I am shuffling these chits and I am taking one chit. And here I have got number 4. So now what I will do is the first entry, the first entry is uh, Narayana school over here. and that Narayana school will be written at number 4 in the fixture sheet. So Narayana school is over. So here I have taken uh, the first entry and here I am just putting a tick mark that is over and this chit will be uh, kept aside and again I am taking I am shuffling the sheets again and now I have taken one more sheet and here I have got number 3 so the number 3 means I have to write in the place of number 3 and uh, which name I am writing the second entry that is Shanti Niketan school so Shanti Niketan school is written in at number 3 position. Shanti Niketan school. Now two places are occupied. Now again I am shuffling these chits. Once again. The third chit. And this is number 2. And here I am writing at number 2 position and the name is the third school that is Oak Ridge school. The third, the third entry uh, school is written at number 2 position. Oak Ridge high school. The same way again I am shuffling the chits. I have taken one sheet and here I have got number 7. So now again I will be writing at number 7 position that is the fourth, fourth entry that is Bluebirds school at number 7 position. Bluebirds school and this sheet will be kept aside and now once again the fifth Chit. and here it is number 5 so number 5 is Alphonsus school here and at number 5th position I will be writing Alphonsus school
Alfonso school and more five chips are there once again I've taken one chit and now I've got number one so number one I have to write at number one position and the name is the sixth school that is Pragati school is written at number one position Pragati school and remaining four chits I'm shuffling again and one chit I've taken and here it is number 10 so I have to write at number 10 position and the next school is Delhi Public School Delhi Public School so you can see we are writing according to the chit the number uh, the position of the uh, number of the chit and we are taking the schools according to their entries I'm shuffling the last three chits and now I've got number nine right and number nine uh, the next school is the eighth eighth entry that is Sherwood school Sherwood school I am writing at number eight position right so more two more are left and I am shuffling these two chits and next number is number eight so this will be written at number eight position and the next school will be the ninth school the ninth entry the supreme school supreme school and the last one left is number six and this will be written at number six position and the tenth school the tenth entry is johnson school right so here uh, all the entries have uh, been uh, taken into this uh, fixture uh, sheet the 10 school the five schools are at the upper half and five schools in the lower half now uh, the next step is we have to uh, take out this uh, bias and you know the formula I have uh, shown in uh, two three videos about how to calculate this uh, um, bias so here uh, the 2 power is uh, after 10 the 2 power next 2 power is 16 so from 16 we have to uh, detect this uh, number of teams that is 10 so 16 minus 10 is 6 so we are getting 6 buys so here first buy will be at number 10 at the lower of last uh, last school and the next buy is the upper half first one and the next buy at lower half the top one and the fourth buy is upper half last one so four are over and again two more are left that is next buy is the ninth one that is a lower half last second and the last buy sixth buy is upper half second second one uh, here uh, six buys are uh, you know, taken and the uh, first match will be played between number three and number four and second match will be played between number seven and number eight right and the buys the buy teams will be played in the second round that is one and two uh, the winner of three and four with number five and the sixth number will be playing with the winner of number seven and eight and number nine and ten will be playing the next match here this is a quarter final and this the winners of the upper half one two winners and three four winner will be playing they will be entering into the semi-finals number six and uh, seven and eight winner and uh, six will be playing with the nine and ten winner and this is a semi-final right this is uh, one two three four teams will be entering the semi-final and the winner of the semi-final will be playing this final and here the winner and under. 
so this is the first method uh, to how to distribute this uh, teams in the upper half and in the lower half according to this address now i'll be showing you the second method